to kick things off with the Monday Nighter. Eight and three Minnesota travels to nine and two Seattle. The Vikings are coming off the bye and a comeback win over Denver. They enter the week as the sixth seed in the NFC. They get a Seahawks squad that is the five seed in the NFC after keeping their road record a perfect 6-0 last week with a win in South Philadelphia. Running back Rashad Penny ran for a career best 129 yards and a touchdown in that win, and they did it without the services of star defensive end Jadavian Clowney. How, what do the insiders say? You know, Dave mentioned uh, Delvin Cook. I, I was stunned. I looked. The guy's got over a thousand yards already. He's only through 11 weeks. He's also got another 450 yards catching the football and having a great, great season. And you've got Kirk Cousins playing like a big game quarterback right now. They're thin at wide receiver, but if those top two are healthy with Thielen and Diggs, this is an offense that'll scare you. You turn it around with Seattle. 28th ranked pass defense. We've talked about this a little bit. Will Cousins take them on? Will they stay with the plan in Seattle and try and go with Delvin Cook? That remains to be seen. For Seattle, uh, you know, Pat just mentioned it. You get Rashad Penny back, he goes off for a buck 27. You got Chris Carson. That's one of the best ground games in the NFL. Yeah, and you, you look at Seattle, I mean, the perception early was that this was a one-man show. You know, uh, uh, Wilson or nothing. Russell Wilson. Well, they're not. They're, they're running the ball. You just mentioned they're playing better defense the last couple of weeks. But Minnesota, I mean, you know, you can, it's one of these teams where you know what they're going to do. They don't make it a secret. They're going to run the ball. It's going to be play action pass, and they are going to play stingy defense. One of the best defenses stopping people when you get in the red zone against them. So, I, you know, I, Seattle, I think, will have a good plan, but I just don't know if Seattle's good enough to score enough points on Minnesota to win the game. Well, it's going to be interesting because Russell Wilson leads the NFL with 24 touchdown passes, and he's got to be licking his lips against that Viking secondary. Hey, they've had 42 plays of 20-plus yards against that secondary. So, yeah, it'll be about who can minimize those big plays. But the quarterbacks are be the topic du jour. But I think it's going to be whoever can get the running game going. We talked about Rashad Penny. I don't know if it's going to be enough. I'm going to stick with the Vikings with you here. Everybody is going with Minnesota win on the road in that one. Next up.